now we'll talk about the history of human population now they are giving the history how the human population has increased they saying about if you talk about 10000 years ago there were about 50 uh, 5 million people living as hunter gatherers hunter gatherers mean the people who were hunting and they are living in the, like a tribes and all their you can say living uh, depends on hunting on these those things one in the form also they were mostly shepherd and all these things so they're saying that they at that time they were almost 5 million significant points in the growth of the human population since then so at that time the population growth was not that much but after that that time with the passage of time population growth increased why due to certain reason for example about 6000 years ago humans started growing crops and rearing animals which provide more food and allow the population to begin to grow so it happens after that the people the human they started to grow the crops and also they raised the animals which are fulfilling their food needs and the population growth increases after that by the time the modern system of counting years started the population was about 250 million before they're saying that when all time there was no systematic mechanism to count the population okay so whatever they are just giving this guess that 10,000 years before the population was 5 million it's like a guess because there's no proper counting before and when the counting system started at that time the what was the population 250 million it then took another 1800 years to reach 1 billion and how much time it took 1800 years to reach to 1 billion after this growth become very rapid and by 1930 it was 2 billion now see here from 2 billion to 4 billion what is the difference 2 billion difference and how much time it took if you subtract them it took uh, almost 45 years before they took 1800 years to reach 1 billion now only in 45 years they reach they become double so why, why this happens because the people they discovered new food new crops and more important things the medical facilities because before the people died due to if, if there is a disease came like in days do you have a corona if this corona happens just like 500 600 years before maybe it will kill a lot of people because at that time medical facilities research that not at that peak now we have now they very quickly they found the reason they found how it is spreading they found the vaccine still they are struggling but this progress is rapid so due to that death rate was death rate is decreased due to that death rate decrease population is increased because population depends on two things number one birth rate number two death rate if you increase the birth rate okay and you decrease the death rate how you can decrease the death rate by good medical facilities if you decrease this death rate and increase the birth rate automatically population will increase so these two things happens in the previous time when the in 45 years the population increased a lot because death rate decrease due to the new invention in medical field and birth rate increase so due to that this happens and now by 200 uh, sorry 2016 it's 7 billion 
and how many years it took 37 years understood these calculations yes khalafullah yes. okay now they are saying the prediction they are saying the prediction depending on the you can say un prediction that what will be the human population in 2100 2100 mean means now we have 22 almost uh, 78 years okay so they are saying estimated actual high variant high possibility medium variant low variant all the possibilities they have mentioned that what will be the human population will be after 78 years mean 2100 so they have given this data according to that data they are saying if you take a human in the high variant mean the things will go smoothly so the population will reach up to this one 14 million okay then you can see here and this is another one here they have given a pop increase in population so this one you you will not memorize that what is the population what the UN said but if the graph is given with the help of the years, you can tell the population. So this is just like a graph they have mentioned here and they predicted the world population. This is by UN. 